in the UFC at present, and when you get some praise from Daniel Cormier, when it comes to your offensive takedown game, you know you're doing something right. And you talk about wrestlers and judo players and grapplers, but this guy just combines all of that. He is able to use foot sweeps from the grappling game. He is able to use throws from judo, and he's able to use wrestling in the, from the wrestling game to take people down. He has an array of takedowns at his disposal, and he uses every single one of them, from the speed of the level change to the timing the knowledge of where to go next. When the guy starts to defend, he's truly, truly something special. I don't think he could take you down, but tonight he doesn't have to. So he does not in this to. matchup, prevailing wisdom is he'll be able to get this fight to the Kings. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed, it was the charisma, it was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's gonna look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Two years apart, these two fighters. Some differences in height and reach as well. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. Ready. Ready to fight. Well, the tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it's gonna be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. A definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Let your hands go. Let those Ooh, blocks go. the shot. Big ball punch land. Now we get back to range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. Beautifully landed by the opposition. Big knee there. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Punch coming, it's blocked. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Nice head kick. And he that comes knee, through with a big knee. That knee hurt him. Right hook attempt. That's a miss. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Able to check the high kick. Whiffs on that offering. And both guys really throwing with authority. Right back in the clinch. Look for the backhand to get very active. Straight right hand, no good. Two minutes have expired off the round one clock here. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Nice defense there, huge block. Effective strike there by Lee. A straight run, he misses. Real quick leg kick. Ooh, head kick lands from his person. Oh, man, huge kick to the 
the body. She went high on that one. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Now a kick to the body. Leg Yet kick. another nice leg kick there by Lee. Kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. And they separate. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Right hand punch from the clinch. Oh! Massive kick to the head. Blocks. Oh, big damaging knees here to the body. Knee to the body. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. Big kick lands. Big head kick. Oh man, don't be afraid to raise the guard as another head kick lands. One more here, DC, and we could be having a referee coming in waving. His waving it off. It could be over in an instant if you do not block head kicks. What a phenomenal job by the offensive fighters setting it up and then throwing that head kick over the top. Nice job setting it up. Good job landing. Great offense. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Lee's head kick looked like that one was blocked. Nice leg kick land. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. What a fight so far. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. That's right. He was all over you, but you're better than that. Come on now, let's shake it out. Let's get back in there, let's get... All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round. And at some point, these are going to really start to take their time. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Nice. Oh, huge block. He's got a serious right punch and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. But how about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Big head kick lands. Oh. It's a nice one, too. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the ladder rounds. Spinning back fist is there. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, big knee. Oh, straight right. Whoa! Two's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Oh! He needs to start looking to 
finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace on uptick. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to oh. take that finish down now. Back to the feet. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice. Beautiful kick. Five single collar tie now. How about that shin? Oh! Huge right hand! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Nice straight punch. Nice stick with the right hand. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Tags him with the left. Big kick lands. Oh man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Nice stick with the right hand. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, single collar tie here. 20 seconds to go round two. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Good punch. Oh, big elbow. He got him. What a round. All right, so a huge round for him there. Nearly had him out of there with the head kick. Did get the knockdown. Talk us through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. All right, next round is now underway. DC, any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the octagon. So even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high-level mixed martial arts. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of... Whoa! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, straight right. Trying to stay in this fight! Big knee! As he gets close and he's out of the kicking range, he'll, start, he'll change his stance. Ooh, big shot land. Oh, head kick blocked by Lee. the body that's a crippling shot there wow he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad big knee to the body oh well he's up but he is hurting for certain the finish could come at any time He's hurt bad. He's hurt bad. 
John. He's got to pressure. He's got to go chase that finish down now. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Telegraph that spinning back fist. Big and kick. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Well, I'm not sure how much more damage he can take to the body. You may want to drop that elbow defensively. Of course, that opens you up to damage upstairs. Pick your poison for him here as he continues to absorb damage. Oh! He's out! He got him! Oh, my goodness, what a fight. Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. All right, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched one. I mean, a competitive fight. That one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called the stop to this contest at two minutes, 10 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Well, there will be no shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I got to think there are a few better feelings in the world than walking into an octagon and Candidly knocking another man out. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man. There's nothing like it. Now, I understand a lot of times we hope for the knockout, but he was never hopeful. He was sure.